Good morning everyone, welcome to a new what I wore in a week. This time it is the holiday edition, which is so exciting. Um, we are going to Barbados. Um, I've never been to the Caribbean before, uh, never done a long haul flight before, so that should be interesting. Um, I'm well equipped, my suitcase is ridiculously heavy and so is my hand luggage, <laughs> so um, should be fun. Um, but yeah, I'm heading off to the airport, it's about eight o'clock now, and I just thought I'd show the first outfit of the day, my travel look. So I've just got this blazer on, I think this is my under the stories one. Honestly, I've got so many black blazers, <laughs> different renditions, but this is my under the stories one, because it's kind of long, which I like. It's also really comfortable, um, like it's a very soft, kind of loose, relaxed blazer, which is obviously what I wanted. Um, to be honest, I probably won't wear the blazer like during the flight or anything, but I just wanted that extra layer. And then I've got this set on from Norba. They're the most beautiful brand. I love their pieces. They're so comfortable. When I say this is like incredibly soft, like it's probably one of the softest things I've ever owned. It's like this sweatshirt set with wide leg trousers, super comfortable. Got my Adidas Continental trainers on. I've just got a white t-shirt layered on underneath as well. And then my earrings are vintage. My hair looks a bit of a mess, but yeah, this is the outfit. I've got my Katie Loxton big bag with me. And uh, I've got my Loewe crossbody that I'm gonna wear across my body. So a long journey ahead of us, um, but I'll catch you um, on the first holiday look. Good morning everyone. Good morning. So it's day one in Barbados. Um, we got here kind of about seven o'clock last night, but we were obviously really tired. So just uh, stayed in the room and then went to sleep fairly early. Um, it's quite early now, obviously, because we're still on UK time. So it's about seven o'clock now, which I think is about 11, 7, 8, 9, 11. No, it's 11, four hours in England. So uh, we're very hungry. Breakfast, uh, only starts at half seven, but we're all ready anyway. Um, so this is my outfit of the day. Um, so it's this set. You may have seen me wear it last year quite a lot. It's from Deji Studios. I might tuck it in actually. I'll do a bit of a half tuck. It's uh, one of their linen sets. I absolutely love them, love the shape of them. Um, and they're just really nice for the beach. Very loose and airy and cool. And then you can kind of use the top alone um just to throw on over your bikini or the same with the shorts um so that is the set i've got this clip on from the way jewelry i've got this is from miss Emma. this is monica vinegar my earrings are from my collection with no skull so is my ring and then bracelets i've got on um all monica vinegar and then oh still looking quite pale at the minute um, but I've got these new sandals. They're the YSL Tribute Sandals in the tan. These are just gonna be so handy every year. The mirror's not the best in here. And then I think I'm just gonna throw on my Loewe cross body and then some sunglasses and good to go for the day. Okay, everyone. So it's evening now. Um, this is what I'm wearing to go out. We're going to a place called QP Bistro, which looks really nice on Instagram, and apparently it's got amazing views. This lighting is not, not the one. Um, but anyway, this is what I'm wearing. It's this dress that I got last you year. Sure I'm sure that's what I'm wearing. I've concluded. This dress I got last year from Jocelyn Studios, um, which was in the net porte sale. This bag from Arquette which is like a big kind of gold clutch. My earrings are from Cos. And then my sandals also gold, going for the gold and white look. Step back so you can see a bit better, but my sandals are from Ancient Greek. Um, so yeah, this is a full look. I'm just thinking maybe we can find some light that might be slightly better. Hello everyone. So it's the next morning now. Um, we had a really nice evening at KP Bistro. So if you are in Barbados, I would really recommend it. It's like split level restaurant with like all open overlooking the sea. And there was a mariachi band uh, playing to everybody live music, which is really nice. Um, so anyway, it's the next morning. We're just about to go to breakfast. You <laughs> get <laughs> Tim's doing his stretches. Um, we're just about to go to breakfast and this is what I'm wearing. I feel like we're catching up a little bit on the time. I think it's about eight o'clock now, so it feels like we're more 
on what? We'll wake up at 10 tomorrow. Yeah. So this set is from by Melina and I absolutely adore it. It's really lightweight. It's also so comfortable. Um, it's also really comfortable um, and I've just got my Anina Bing sandals with it. I feel like my tan needs to catch up with my holiday looks. Um, I love my sunglasses and then these earrings. I can't remember where they're from. Um, but yeah, this is outfit of the day. Um, I might just wear this by the pool and just maybe just keep the shorts on. Um, I'm not sure, but anyway, um, I'm very hungry, so let's get going. show you really quickly this um, cover up which is also from by Melina it's later in the day now um, and I decided to just throw this on because I thought it was a little bit easier than the shorts and t-shirt um, so it's like a kind of it is sheer um, cover up from uh, by Melina like I say it's just a really cute print and I really like these kind of tie up um, robes like this because I just find them so much easier for the beach just to kind of chuck on and then if you want to go and grab a drink you feel like you're kind of covered up enough so yeah that is outfit of the day for the rest of the day um by the beach we've got a sunbed right on the beach side so um yeah i'm gonna take my book and enjoy the rest of the day hi everyone so it is evening time as you can probably tell I'm hoping we might be able to do something about the lighting because it is so yellowy um, on the camera. So hopefully we'll be able to fix that. Anyway, this is what I'm wearing. It's another outfit from By Melina. I don't know why it's ended up that I'm wearing all my outfits from them today. But this is a dress uh, they sent over, which is absolutely stunning. Got this kind of low back cutout detail here. It's really comfortable, lightweight, linen. It's got these puffy sleeves, which you know I love puffy sleeves. And then I've paired it with my ancient Greek black sandals. Some red lipstick by Under the Stories. Monica Vanilla necklace. My hoops from my collection with North School. Daphne ring, uh, North School ring, and then another. That's a Monica Vanilla ring there. So yeah, this is outfit of the night. We're going for Japanese night, sushi. Uh, very hungry, looking forward to it. There's Tim. I'm gonna show you our outfit of the day. No? Um, no, okay. It's just the usual. The usual, usual. So men have it so easy when it comes to dressing. Like, nice shorts and a linen shirt. Can you sort it? Do you like it's just, it's just throwing it on, isn't it? Anyway, this is the outfit, so um, are you ready to go? I'm gonna put my little Bottega bag with it too. This is a bag. I'm gonna pop with it. I feel like I can hear someone singing. Maybe not singing, but uh, music, I think. Oh, actually. This is our room, and that is the sea right there. Anyway, uh, time to go out, and I'll catch you in tomorrow's outfit. Good morning, everybody. So it's the next day, the next morning. Uh, we're just about to go to breakfast, and this is what I'm wearing. So it's this Deji Studios um, dress. It's like quite a long dress which I got last year, but I had to shorten the straps. The straps are like ridiculously long. I don't really know how anyone could have worn it. Um, so anyway, I shortened the straps and it works really nicely now. Um, I've got this necklace on from my collection with North Skull and the earrings. And then this is Missima. And then my YSL sandals. Let's go and stand back so you can see. And my Bottega sunglasses as well. outfit of the morning. 
So I just thought I'd show you what I've changed into for the pool today. We're actually just going to sit around the pool. We've just been for a walk right down the beach, um, past a few other hotels. We saw the oldest church in Barbados, which I think was from the 1630s. Um, so we've had a little kind of wander around the local area, which was really nice, really nice to walk along the beach as well. Um, but we're just gonna sit by the pool now and do some reading. So this is what I'm wearing. Is this, this is from Vita Grace. It's an oldie, but it's one of my favorites. And I think if you can get your hands on like a kind of linen-y caftan like this with a belt, I just think the belted dress type caftans are the best ones because they're just so easy to get on and off. You can kind of wear them half and done um, and they just look quite chic as well. So um, I've got this on, like I say, from Vita Grace, but it's a little bit old now. Um, I don't think they do them, but if you can find something similar, I would recommend. And then I've just got my Anina Bings on again. Take a sunglasses, um, Monica Veneta chain, and then my earrings from my collection with North Skull. And then this is just like an old, I say old, I think it's from last year, bikini from and other stories which you can kind of put uh, off the shoulders or you can just kind of wear it on the shoulders like this and it kind of goes with it because it's pink. I find that when I'm on holiday my style really kind of gets a bit more fun and I really enjoy wearing colour and print and that kind of thing um, which is so different to when I'm at home because it's very minimal so I just kind of use the opportunity when I'm away to bring out those brighter pieces and these are pieces because I don't wear them so often um, I'm really excited to wear them so I do keep wearing them even though they are like kind of bright colours so I've had this for about three years now and it's lasted really well and it comes out each holiday with me so yeah it's just nice to kind of change things up a bit and have a bit of fun I think it totally also depends on your location so for example if I was in Paris or on holiday, kind of in a city or um, something like that, then I would probably go for my more usual and minimal kind of style. But then when you're on kind of tropical, warm holiday, it's nice to go for these really bright colors. So yeah, I just thought I'd mention that considering um, I'm out of my usual um, neutrals and minimal style, um, but I'm really enjoying it. And I just love doing this when I'm on holiday. Hi everyone, so evening is upon us and I'm actually just getting a few shots before we go out to dinner. Um, I don't know, I don't think I'm gonna wear this tonight. I might wear it tomorrow, but it is a little bit restrictive when you're eating, but it's such a good dress. I just couldn't miss the opportunity to shoot it. Um, but I might still wear it tomorrow. I feel like I really need to wear it because it's just such a good dress. So it's by Leo Lynn. Um, it's just the most amazing huge puff sleeves, square neckline in this kind of buttery yellow color. I've got it with the ancient Greek sandals. It even has pockets. This would be a great one for a summer wedding. I just think it's so fab. And then these cult Gaia earrings. I just put my Celine scrunchie in. So I just had to show it you whilst the light was still good. I'm just gonna see if Tim will get a vlog clip of me wearing this outside. <laughs> He's fed up with me bossing him around for pictures. Um, but yeah, we're gonna just do a quick, I'll show you a quick one of this in some more natural light. Is what I'm actually wearing tonight. Um, so it's this dress from, hi, um, where is this dress from? By, uh, no, it's not from there. So it's from a brand called Marissa. Hopefully you can see in this light, um, but it's like this kind of pinky, one shoulder cut out kind of dress. Um, I've gone for this Karilu bag, which has got the pink in. And then these Zara earrings from last year, the leaf print. Um, and then my ancient Greek sandals again. This can just go over the shoulder. Um, but we're gonna go and get some pics before the light goes. So I'll try and get this dress videoed in the light as well, because I know my evening outfits are kind of suffering with the early sunsets. So let's go. Good morning everybody. Um, obviously it's the next morning. 
Uh, we've just had breakfast actually, um, so I'm filming this post breakfast. I'm always feeling very full after breakfast, but um, this is what I'm wearing for today. I think we're gonna go and head to um, one of the beach bars somewhere else on the island and maybe have a little explore around there. Just kind of see where the day takes us. I think we're gonna do that in a couple of hours um, and just maybe sit by the pool for an hour or two uh, this morning and then do that later on. So this is what I'm wearing. It's this really nice set. Um, this was sent to me by a brand called Kasaraki. They're quite a well-known kind of linen, summery kind of brand. Um, and this set is just kind of the perfect linen set. It's just done really well, like the sleeves, the big thick cuffs, um, the shape of it, the length of the shirt, you can kind of wear this on its own as a cover up if you wanted to. You could wear the shorts alone as a cover up as well. They're just like a really nice, nicely done pair of shorts and then you could wear the shorts with a different top. You could dress this up in the evening as well if you wanted to, but I'm just wearing it as a kind of beachside look. I've got this Hunza G bikini on, which is like a high-waisted twist knot shape. <laughs> Um, my necklace is from my collection with Norska Woman, with the pearls, lovely sunnies, um, the way clip, earrings again from my collection and my Monica Vinader bracelets and then finishing off with my YSL sandals. I'll put my Loewe basket bag with it too, like this. And uh, that is my finish and beach day look. Hi everyone, so it's evening time now. Let's sort this light out. It's absolutely terrible lighting. Um, but anyway, this is what I'm wearing. We are just about to go out. I actually got ready in such a rush because I thought our booking was at quarter past eight. It turned out it was at 7.30. So um, yeah, I had 45 minutes less than I thought. So I quickly um, threw this on, not had chance to iron it, but I don't think it really needs ironing to be honest. It's this Joanna Ortiz dress. That I got in a charity sale last year. It's absolutely beautiful. It's like the perfect holiday evening dress. I'm wearing it with my sandals from Ancient Greek um, and then my earrings are from Cos. You just passed me my bag. Um, and then my bag, no not that one, <laughs> the beaded one. <laughs> That's my purse. Oh. There are three bags on the bed. This one. Uh, from Cult Gaia. It's like a beaded situation. But we're going to a place called The Lone Star tonight, which has been most recommended um, by everybody I've come across, everybody I know said go there. So really looking forward to it. And hopefully it should be a lovely evening. I've not even had a chance to do anything with my hair. So I don't know whether I'm gonna leave it like this or tie it back. But anyway, outfit of the night um, and I'll catch you tomorrow. Good morning everyone. It's now Monday morning. This is what I'm wearing. We're heading down to breakfast quite early this morning because we've got a catamaran trip booked to go and swim with the turtles and to see some shipwrecks. So yeah, we're up and out quite early. So this is what I'm wearing. It's this dress from the Frankie shop, which I absolutely love. Underneath I've got this. This is from by Marissa. It's like a really pretty bikini. Um, it's like this white, almost like a kind of scallop detail. It's really nice anyway. Um, and then I sell sandals, my lower face sunglasses, and then my hoops from um, my collection with North School. So um, that is what I'm wearing for heading down to breakfast this morning. I might just keep this cover up on, this shirt dress as a cover up for the rest of the day. Okay, so it's the evening now. Um, we had such a great boat trip today. Saw some turtles, swam with the turtles, um, stingrays, puffer fish, um, loads of other fish that I've no idea what they were, but, but it was such a good time. We also saw two shipwrecks as well. Um, I am a little bit scared of water, especially the sea. Um, I have a bit of a phobia of the sea. Um, and I was really proud of myself because I got in there and did it. Um, I was a little bit hesitant with the snorkel, um, but I, I kind of made it work in the end um, and I just about did it, but I was so glad I did because what we saw was so amazing um, and kind of one of those things that whilst you're here, you've got to do it. So I was really glad we did it in the end, but now I'm feeling a little bit ropey from the boat because it was quite choppy on the way back. We did a bit of a sail around the island and en route back, it was very, very bumpy. So now I'm like all over the place a bit. 
So we're just gonna keep it simple tonight and eat in the hotel. This is what I'm wearing. So it's my hoops from my collection with North School Women. Um, and then this gorgeous dress from Sansia. Hopefully you can see it better there with my ancient Greek sandals. And then um, I'm going to put on my cult Gaia bag with it as well. Just gonna add this bag here. And that is the finished look for tonight. Um, and then tomorrow is our last full day. I feel like it's flown by actually, don't you? I feel like we've only just got here. This is why you need to do two weeks. I know. Um, so yeah, I'll of the night. Good morning, everyone. So we're on to the next morning now. Um, and we had a lovely dinner last night at the hotel, um, but it's breakfast time again. And this is what I'm wearing this morning. So it's this set from Sansia. See the back there. Um, you may have seen me talk about Sansia a lot before. They do the most amazing belts. Some of my best, most worn belts are from Sansia, um, but they also do clothing. Um, so I've got this little set on, which is so cute. I love this back detail on it. And then I just need to sort this bow out a little bit, but they've got like a kind of lace up style shorts in this kind of khaki with the puff sleeves, Monica Vinader necklace. Um, and then these are from my collection with North School and my Loewe hoops uh, to finish it off. So, oh, I might buy a sell sandals. So that is outfit of the morning for our second to last day. Okay, everyone. So it's our final night now. Um, this is what I'm wearing for our last night. Very sad to be leaving. We've had such a lovely time feeling a lot more relaxed now um, and just really enjoyed our time here. Um, so I've got this dress on from Dish. This is the first time I've worn this, but I have many dish pieces and really, really like them. So it's this black linen dress. It's got a bit of a cutout here and you could wear this in the day and then dress up at night as well. So I've got it on here with, I've got this um, on with my chunky North School Raffia necklace. Um, my lipstick is from Illamasqua. I don't think they do it anymore though. Does Illamasqua even still exist? I admit, did they? I feel like they don't exist anymore. Um, but it's such a good colour. Um, and I'm so upset that they don't do this anymore because it's like the best orange red. Um, my little sandals, I think I'm going to put my Bottega bag with it as well. So this is the final night look. It's just kind of got a plain back as well. But I would really, really, really recommend dish pieces. I feel like they're kind of the perfect summery pieces that kind of have a bit of a twist to them. Um, they're not just like a simple black linen dress. Like I like this cutout detail and the big band. And I just feel like everything about the way they're designed is really good and just has a lot to it for being like a kind of summer dress. Like it's even got the double lining on the skirt, if you can kind of see that there. So yeah, it's just a really, really nice piece. Big fan of this. So it's been such a lovely time. I've got lots more on my Instagram, um, so you can head over there. Um, I don't think there'll be necessarily any more outfits as such, but there'll be more outfit details. Um, what else will I be showing you? I'll, I think I might do a QA and a as well, maybe, um, of where we stayed, etc. We stayed at a hotel called The Sandpiper, which was absolutely beautiful. Really, really enjoyed it. Everything about it, the grounds are absolutely stunning. The food was beautiful. The setting is right by the beach. It's got a gorgeous pool. It's got two gorgeous pools. Um, everything about it was just beautiful, so I would highly recommend it. Um, but yeah, I, mean, I think I might do an Instagram Q&A. Um, so if you want to see a little bit more about the holiday, um, not just the outfits, then I might do that over there and save it to a highlight. Um, and then obviously more outfit shots, etc., over there too. It's just at Lydia Jane Tomlinson if you don't follow me already. And also whilst we're here, we realized that we got to 700,000 subscribers on YouTube. So maybe we should just celebrate that time got his headphones on so I'm just talking to myself here. We'll celebrate the 700,000 tonight anyway. Thank you so much for watching. If you've subscribed then it really does mean the world. I really appreciate it. Never know whether to look in the mirror or I just feel very weird looking at myself in the mirror so I'm better looking in the camera. Um, but if you have already subscribed then I hugely appreciate it. If you haven't then please do um, give me a subscribe. If you like this kind of holiday outfits video um, then let me know. Thank you so much and I'll see you very soon.